Stan Jabalisco here, proprietor and operator of amateur radio station W1GV Whiskey One Good Vibrations. A viewer asked me a question uh, in one of the comments of the video I did just before this one, but it, I considered it irrelevant to the video, but nevertheless of interest generally. His question, how far can a wave travel if its period is one microsecond? Uh, well, that depends on the medium through which it travels, but assuming it's a vacuum, uh, the formula is 300 million divided by the frequency uh, 300 million divided by the fre uh, divided by the frequency in hertz, or 300 divided by the frequency in megahertz. Now, a wave with a period of one microsecond would have a frequency of one megahertz. So, the wavelength in a vacuum, where the velocity factor is 100 percent, would be 300. Uh, divided by 1, or 300 meters. And that is how far a wave with a period of 1 microsecond would travel through a vacuum uh, in one cycle. That is 1 microsecond. So 300 meters is the answer to that question, but uh, in general you can get a lot more information, and here's a good chance for me to make a sales pitch, okay? You can get a lot more information about this kind of stuff in my book, Teach Yourself Electricity and Electronics. You can get any edition of the book. Um, there are six of them. The most recent is the sixth edition. Of course, that's the one I would recommend that you get. And so, have a good, uh, have a good uh, learning session there. And if you want, you can pirate my book or you can get it for practically free. But please don't pirate it. Please don't do that. You can get used copies, though, for practically nothing. Teach Yourself Electricity and Electronics. Sixth edition. Recommended. Stangibalisco W1GV saying 73, which means best regards in ham radio jargon, and so long, which, regardless of the frequency in CW, my native fist translates to da 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 da.